going on everybody out there in YouTube land? How is everybody doing this wonderful day? So I got a pretty crazy one for you today. So a couple days ago I had an idea and I think that we should do that right now. That idea was to take a big chunk of Plastisol. This is three cups of Plastisol. This is in dead on plastics jerk baked swim bait. Kind of a tongue twister there. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a scoop of every glitter I have on the shelf here with a quarter teaspoon right here. And what I'm going to use, I'm going to use two different sizes. I'm going to use the zero, I'm sorry, 0 0.015 and a 0 0.040. I, so like I have these two in purple, I'm going to put a scoop of that and a scoop of that. And we're going to do that for all the other glitters there. I just counted them up a few minutes ago. There's 39 of them. So we're going to put 39 scoops of glitter in this three cups of plastic salt, mix it up and just start shooting molds and see what kind of crazy baits that these make. I don't know if these will work, but I think it's going to be a lot of fun to try it out. So I'm going to get to cooking this plastic. This is going to take quite a bit of time to cook this, and then we're going to start putting this glitter in there and mix it up, and we're going to shoot molds until we can't shoot anymore. So stay tuned. All right, everybody, so here it is. There is three cups of plastic saw up to temperature. So I think some of this glitter might change the color of it. So I'm going to put a little bit of black in here just to give it just a little bit of boom i think one maybe maybe two yeah i'm just gonna do one one is done yeah that's still nice and clear but in case any of these colors do bleed which they shouldn't these are actually made for baits they're supposed to be heat resistant but there might be one or two in here so let's get started so start with chartreuse Look at that, even, it's in there. Okay, get that little on tight though. Orange. Small orange. Purple. I'm sorry for all that's happened. I don't want to mix my colors though. So I'm doing my best to clear these up. Trying to go fast. Blue, run a little low on blue. Small blue. This is gonna be awesome. This is gonna be like epic. I'm trying to figure out what I name these baits. Leave it down in the comments what you would name these baits once you see them. Small red. Oh my god, that's a lot of glitter. And then this is a uh, 0.015 string glitter. But it's black, so we'll do a big heaving of this one. There we go. Alright, we're gonna mix this one. Come on, get on there. Alright. I'm just gonna mix it up, see what happens. Look at that. That's cool. You see that? And we're like halfway there maybe. Sweet. I'm going to get set up for the next row. I'll be back in a minute. Round two. A lot of greens. So this is teal. Teal small. Medium teal. There's still another round after that. Oh, that went everywhere. Why'd you do that to me, teal? Small pink. Medium. 
medium pink. Making a mess. Don't like it. Kelly Green. Small. Kelly Green Medium. Now we got Emerald Green. Look at that. That's a good color. Emerald Green Medium. And these are from Dead On Plastic. This is like Meteor. Black. Kind of like all kinds of holographic black, basically. Changes colors. It's a good one. Dead on plastics sky. It's cool looking blue. Dead on plastics Barney. Look at that. Pretty cool. And then Dead On Plastic Sunrise. All the outer glitters we're using today are from Lure Works. All right, let's mix this up and see what it looks like. Holy cow. Look at that. That's getting crazy. I still have a round three to go. All right, I'm going to put this away and get ready for round three. Stay tuned. Round three, and it's a big one. So we got gum metal. This is not a lure works one. I don't know where I got this. Somebody gave this to me. We got white. Holographic, I think it is. Yep. Big scoop of that. Got gold. Small. Gold medium. Holographic. Point uh, zero one five. Put a big scoop of that one. Look at that. Yeah, dance that around. That's crazy. Silver. Small. Silver medium. Gold holographic medium. Gold holographic small. Copper, small. Well, that's a good, that's a heaving one right there. That's a good one. And then copper, medium. This one is not by Lyraworks either. All the other ones were. Or dead on plastics. Alright, let's mix this. See what it looks like. This is it. This is all of it. Holy cow, that's thick. That's thick. You should you believe, believe how I should have weighed this before I put all the glitter in it to see how much it weighed. And there's our color. Check that out. That's crazy looking. I am super psyched. I can't wait to shoot molds with this. All right, I'm going to clean up my mess here. I'm going to cook this for a little bit, get it back up to temperature. And we're going to start shooting molds next time you see this. All right, we are ready for round one here, so let's do this. Get a huge chunk up. All right, there's the first one. Top it off a little bit. See if I can get the second one done with this injector. Yep, got it. 
Okay, here we go. I'm gonna fill these up a little bit before I do the second round because they eat a lot of plastic. There we go. Those are good for now. Second injector. Filling it up. stop me there we go fill that one up fill that one back up fill that one back up there's probably enough to do this one. this is a pretty small mold and there we go oh I don't think that other one filled up we'll see we'll see oh yeah yeah I think we got it I think we got it it's just the top of the sprue look at that Look at that. That is crazy. What a cool idea. All right, we're going to let them cool down for a second. This one's actually drinking a little bit of blast. Let's fill it back up there. All right. There's those. Let this cool down for a few minutes, and then I'll show you what they look like. All right, who is ready to see these? So let's go with these first. Whoa. A good spin. All right, who's ready? You ready? Oh yeah, those are cool looking. Look at those. Huh, the old five inch stick bait. That looks cool. Yeah, that'll do. Cool. I also did the other one too. Thought it'd be cool to have two rounds of stick baits in there. There we go. Same as that one. That's cool. All right, set those to the side. All right, these ones right here, I think everybody's gonna like these ones. These ones should look pretty cool. Come on, get off the glitter. Big mold. All right, ready? Here we go. Look at that, it's the frogs. That's cool looking too. We'll set those over there and pull them out. Check that out. That's crazy. Look at that. Look at all that glitter in there. That's awesome. And then these. Those are good turns. Are the twirly tail grubs. Look at that. That's cool. Let's get them out of there too. Check that out. Wow, that is amazing. I am psyched. I am psyched. This is cool. What a great idea. All right, let's get ready for round two. All right, so I recycled all the uh, sprues and stuff, filled the cup back up. And here we go, round two. Here we go. Nice big injector full. A little pressure. That was good. Sounds good. That was good. Close up. I know I'm getting messy, but a lot of molds in front of us. All right. Got this one right here. And then we'll do this one. All right, fill that one up, fill that one up, and that one. All right. We'll let them cool down for a little bit, and we'll do the reveal. All right, let's take a look at these. So, look at these first. Look at those. So these are flukes. Pull them out nice and easy. Look at that. That's crazy. That's awesome. We're going to put those there. A little wing nut action here. All right. These are the grass grenades. Oh, holding on there. Look at that. That's cool. Let's take those out of there. Yeah. I like them. I dig them. All right, 
little bit more wing nut action here. All right, here we go. Oh, that's that's stuck on this. Pop that up with the butter knife. All right. Check those out. The old knuckle draggers. That's cool. Look at that. That's amazing. So yeah, let's get those out of there. Check that out. Cool. And then last but not least is the slouches. Oh, they stayed in the mold too. Look at that. That's cool. Check that out. Let's pull them out of there. So let me just grab one here. There we go. Pull that off. Look at that. The old Epi Bait slouch. That's cool. That's cool. So we don't have very much plastic left, but I want to do one more mold. So I went in and grabbed some clear. So this is clear with holographic. This is clear with some black flake. And this is clear with a little bit of like uh, it's called snow sheen from uh, Dead On Plastic. So we're going to cut these up. Put it with the glitter, with the rest of the sprues and runners on that, and we're gonna shoot one more bait. So stay tuned. All right, so I have this back up to temperature here. Little swirls. I had a little bit of plastic so I could do this mold. As you can see, what mold it is. This is the Epic Bait 12-inch grub. I can't wait to see this mold in this glitter color here. This is awesome. Holding pressure, holding pressure. It's a big mold. Takes a lot of plastic. And then we're just gonna keep filling it up. There we go. Put the rest of this in there, just a little bit left over. All right, we're gonna let that cool down for a little bit, actually for a while. And then I'll, uh, I'll show you what it looks like. I'm excited. All right, everybody. I think I might have saved the best for last. So let's open this big boy up. Oh yeah. Check that out. Let me fix this tail. Let me get this tail looking good. Look at that. That is cool. That is really, really cool. Yes. Let's get that big boy out of there. Look at that. That is so freaking neat. So let's clip off the... Uh, runner which is that right there look at that 12 inch grub baby i will try this and see if i can catch a muskie on it that is cool all right i like that all right everybody so here is all the baits we did the slouches the grass grenades the knuckle draggers the flukes twirly tail worms the frogs check out those frogs and the stick baits they all came out looking fantastic. And there's this one, the 12 inch grub. This thing came out spectacular. I can't say enough about it. This thing is really, really cool. Um, will these catch fish? I have no idea. I'll definitely give them a try out there. But one thing I want to know is if you were going to name this color, what would you name it? Put your answer down in the uh, comment section down there. And tell me what you would name this color. I think there's all kinds of crazy names you could come up for this, but I'd like to hear what you all would say. But yeah, I can't complain. I mean, these are cool. I had a blast doing it, and that's one of the fun things about making your own baits is you can do anything you want. Like if you want to take every glitter you have and put a quarter teaspoon in some plastic and mix it together, see what it comes up with, you can do it. That's what's so much fun about doing this hobby. But that's going to do it for this one, y'all. I appreciate you watching. If you wouldn't mind, please like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you on the next one. Thanks again.